Seneca de Vita Beata, Episode 10. Itaqua id evenit quod in comitiis, in quibus eos factos, esse praetordres idem qui facere remirantur, cum se mobilis favor circum egit. Eadem probamus, eadem reprehendimus, hic exitus est omnis judicii in quo secundum plurdres datur. Now he says, and so, that thing happens, id evenit which happens in elections, comitiis, elections in which, in quibus. Now here the syntax becomes a little bit complicated, so let's take it apart. Eos factos esse praetores, those that have been made praetors, the same persons who made them or elected them, this is what facera means here from facio, facera, the same persons who have elected them admire them, mirantur. Now, when looking at this verb, fakera, you might naturally think it is the infinitive of fakara, and that's an easy mistake to make. But notice fakio, fakara, the infinitive looks like this, but fakera is built on the third principle's part, faki. And we have what here occurs often in poetry, but less common in prose, namely a syncopated perfect. The full form is fake runt. This is not uncommonly in poetry shortened to the form that we actually have, fekere. It is more unusual in prose, however. So let's take another look at the syntax here. Those persons, eos, that have been made praetors, as a praetores. Here's our subject, idem, and it is the subject of mirantur. It is masculine, plural, and nominative. The same persons, qui fekere, here it is as the parenthetical, the same persons who made them or elected them praetors, admire them. When, here's a parenthetical, you might say, favor mobilis, when the fickle or movable favor or preference surrounds or comes round upon itself. Kirkum egit se. And as always, this se here in the masculine, singular, and accusative is reflexive. It reflects back on the subject, which is favor. In other words, the electorate tends to favor those whom they have elected. And his point will be that in matters de vita beata, Seneca's point, matters that concern the good life and how to live properly and ethically, such group decisions, such mob think, have no place. The consequence, eadem probamus, we approve of the same things. Eadem in the neuter, plural, and accusative. We approve of the same things we find fault with reprehendemus, the same things. And you'll notice that there is no conjunction here linking together probamus and reprehendemus. This omission of a conjunction is called ascendaton, when you leave out the conjunction. It's from a, sun, and deton, no linking together. And it's very common in Latin prose, especially in Seneca's style, where he's trying to show great contrast. Eadem probamus, eadem reprehendemus. This is the outcome, Seneca con concludes. Exitus means result or event, and hic refers to what has come before. This is the result or outcome of every judgment in which it is rendered, and the subject of datur is an implicit eudicium. A judgment is rendered, verdict is returned, when it is returned secundum plures, according to the majority. In other words, we cannot trust the mob or the majority in ethical matters concerning the happy life. We hope you have enjoyed this series on Seneca.